Right, we are now moving on to the cistern. And I have to, um... Oh, there's a rat down here, isn't there? There's the air. Hi. Ah, die, die. God, the rats are like three feet long in this game. Um, I have to say that as much as I adore this level, and I do because it brings back a lot of uh, positive memories about this game, playing it for the first time. Um, I'm, I always get lost in it, like always, you know. And I think I've sort of developed a bit of a system over time, or I think it's probably helped. Um, uh, oh, Lara, don't do that. Uh, you know, like once we got YouTube, and I could actually watch other people doing it and see how they they approach playing this game and playing other games because. Uh, I used to get so lost in this level so so much and I think it was because of the whole I, I was getting hung up in the whole um, oh hi guys uh, uh, raise the water to go into this place and then lower the water to go into this place or get this uh, medipack or some kind of pick up somewhere um, and I think my brain just can't quite cope with that you know it's the same with uh, there's a bit in anniversary I think it's actually a bit of the St Francis's Folly stuff where you have to raise the water and lower the water and my brain just does not like that at all I just I can't seem to quite c compute that stuff properly I don't know why but yeah despite the fact that uh, Palace Midas was a really huge level the scale of this game didn't hit me until I came running out here and just looked into this area for the first time and then that's when it just hit me like standing right here looking out at this was when I just suddenly thought I love this game this game's incredible um, and of course in the PC version the sound is awful so I turned the music off but I think uh, in the PlayStation version the, the main Tomb Raider theme kicks in here and uh, I believe I will be sticking it back in and editing just to make the memory complete but yeah, I always get funny, happy feelings when when I step out into this bit here. Now, that rat is frozen. And we can't lock onto it yet, so we'll hop on over here. Hi! Gosh, they die quite quickly actually. Ah, shimming. I suppose uh, we could actually jump down and then climb back up, but um, who, who, who can deprive themselves from a nice little bit of shimmying? Yeah, this always amused me, the way they're chasing Lara's shadow. There must be some kind of little computer glitch or something for, you know, the, the... Dare I actually call it AI, but the AI of the rats thinks that that's actually Lara. Oh, shotgun shells! I don't think I've got any, I think I've wasted them all on gorillas in the, the previous level. Yeah, I think another reason why I really latched onto this level is, you know, like if you look in the... Oh, I don't think I can do it while I'm shimmying. But, you know, like in the corners and on the floor down there, you know, like you can see all this green shittiness. And it's... I mean, th this level is basically a giant to toilet bowl. I mean, it's called Cistern, um, and I think you really feel it that this is. Uh, um, uh, 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 <laughs> you can feel the mouldiness and the shabbiness. You know, like you can see it in the the bits that are its feet as well. Just this green mouldy yuckiness, um, and you know, I don't remember having that same feeling playing Anniversary. There was something a bit more. Sanitized, maybe. It didn't. You didn't get that sort of feeling of, you know. I think maybe uh, one could argue Crystal Dynamics likes to go for the glamour a little bit more. Maybe it's a symptom of a more modern age of of uh, the kind of graphics we have now. But um, yeah, you sort of get a shabby shittiness about this place. But that's kind of what makes it so memorable. Now we could go in there just now, but I think we need to just kind of head back. Um, 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 um. Do we? Oh, bo 
vlogging it, I should have just jumped off the edge back there. Ah, uh, right, okay. So we're not going to go up in there now because uh, that raises the water and I think what we should actually do is just drop down here and head over into that first room that we got the key for. Um, yeah, I think that will actually and get the first silver key. Because I think that system tends to work a little bit better than getting that. I used to uh, running jump. Oh, uh, I used to get both rusty keys first, and that that involved a lot of uh, raise the water, lower the water, and I think that's what just confuses me. Uh, I'm fairly certain it's this door. Fuck, fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. I feel, I feel at life. Right. Wonderful. Right, let's try this jump again. So, back. Uh, grab it, grab it, grab it. Oh, there we go. Oh, weird creepy face. This game, I, I, I never really noticed it until I was playing the, I think it was, yeah, the iPad version. It's got a bit of a, a upgraded graphics. And I never realised, oh, f no, 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 up, 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 um, I never realised till the iPad version that um, there's a lot of creepy faces in this game. You know, like, it's just all over the architect and, and everything. Creepy faces everywhere. Right, come on guys, come on, come on. Oh, I don't want to jump over to the next platform because I think that that's what triggers Pierre's going to turn up. If I go too far ahead. Oh fuck it, let's just go back down. Come on guys, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on. Oh shit, oh shit, die already. Die, 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 die. Right, okay, cool, yeah. Um, it's just occurring to me, actually, Pierre, oh, for fuck's sake, Lara, Pierre doesn't turn up at all in Palace Midas. Maybe that's another reason why it's so good. <laughs> Come on, dude, where are you? Although it is one of the oh 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 so sneaky. Where did you wait? How does he do that? I mean, he he must have a portal gun. He must because I don't understand how we're the one opening the doors and the um uh, uh solving the puzzles and all that, and yet he is always one step ahead of us. I mean, how does he do that? Come on, dude, just run 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 into a pillar and disappear. There we go. Oh, Lara, where am I? Why have I got you sidestepping like an idiot? Right, running jump. Now, there is some trick. I think I mentioned this in the previous level that there's some... There's ammo over there or there's something. I... I've never quite been able to figure out how to how to get to it I mean I thought uh, I, I used to try doing the whole grabbing the, the bit that we have to shimmy along um, and then dropping down but I, I just mm. oh gosh I'm very high up and I haven't saved yet oh panic 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 save Right, so, a brave person would just jump right over there. Sometimes I screw this up as well and fall. Yeah, well, as a braver person than I am, I think I would just die on the spot if I was that high up on anything. Right. 
Oh, there's a, a... There is a croc in here, I believe. Oh, hi there. Oh, still quite high up. Come on, Lara. easy to to defeat I remember them being oh shit there's two of them now I do not remember there being two of them fucking hell they're, they're, oh just come on there, there is not three in here is my game glitching there was not three of them in here there's like one isn't there oh I don't remember this many yeah, I believe there's some something back. Oh Jesus fucking Christ! Oh man, this game. Twenty years and it's still scaring the shit out of me. If if I could ask the makers of this game just one thing. I, I think I would want to know if they deliberately set out to make this game pants soilingly scary or <laughs> or whether that just kind of happened anyway. Um, oh, come on, Lara. Forward, thank you. Hmm, now I know you're supposed to go over the platforms and drop off and shimmy along, but can you not just do a running jump here? Oh, you can. Yeah. Saved. I shouldn't save again. Right, okay. No! Oh, fuck, I should have saved. <laughs> oh, I thought you kind of jumped and dangled and shimmied along, but maybe you're just supposed to jump at an angle. Right, okay, well, we'll just have to try that then, won't we? Go! Oh. Well, since I'm here, I might as well just try this. I don't think I've ever done that. I think I've just tried shimming right. Let's see if let's see if three crocs turn up again. Hi. Oh yep, 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 yep. I don't remember there being this many. So am I basically massacring a family here? Hey, it's the Lara Croft way. I'm ready for you, rat. Fuck you. Yeah. <sighs> right, let's try this again. Damn it, Lara. Up, 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 up. I think we will save here again. Ah, save. 
so is it like a sort of jump to an angle, I think. Like this. There we go. Oh shit. Oh fuck it. Let's just. Bye. Right, what bit am I in? I don't like this. Oh, hi. Oh yes, so I need to um, do not fall in the pool of water. It's one of those pissing annoying pools of water. If you fall in it, you, you can't climb back out. I don't know why they thought that was good game design. Um, yeah. Oh, could I have just... I going? I oh yes 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 yes. I suppose I could have just. Well, I suppose maybe the pool that um, I suppose the idea is that the pool of water was you know your safety net in the earlier levels, but now it's something that's actually a danger to you. But oh god, I mean, I remember that being a major frustration. You know trying to figure out how to play this level back in the day and where to go and you know like just one just one mistake and it would just fuck everything up and you'd have to go all the way but back round and you know do whole sections again and oh it was such a pain in the arse and you know like really the the level design you know, like if you, oh shit, 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 fuck ours. Right, okay. Um, the, you know, like if you if you, if you were to look at a floor plan of this level, it's probably not that complicated. But um, oh god, I've come around the wrong way. Um, but I think that I think the frustration just lay in the fact that you know you would have to. You just have to go back and forth and back and forth and and you know like all the rooms are very samey. So uh, why do I, oh gee, I was just about to say that why do I get the feeling Pierre is about to turn up because he bloody does. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. Oh man, he is such a. Right, does that mean he's gone? <sighs> he is such a son of a bitch in this level. Um, I think we can jump into the pool now. Yeah, this level and uh, the next level, Tuma to Hawken. He is such a son of a bitch in it. You know, like he just. He Oh, right. Aye, so there's this room, but we can't get to this stuff up there until we raise the water up. Right, okay, whatever. Oh, hi! Oh! Alright, oh, okay, it's just... Oh, no, is there two of them? What the fuck? Is it? Is it this PC version just, um... Okay, I need to get out the water, I need to get out the water. Oh, as amusing as it is to have crocodiles floating in the middle of the air, I think we're going to deal with these guys here just now. I think there's a secret here as well, isn't there? There's an alcove. Oh, was it just the one? Oh shit, no, no, no. She aimed her guns just as, just as I was getting her back in the water. There we go. Right, so alcove. Is it this one that's the. No, that's. Oh. Maybe it is actually. Or is that where I just came from? Nope. Oh. Magnum clips. I'm forgetting I turned my music off so I can't actually hear the chime. <sighs> And was that where I just came from? Right, so we need to go raise the water now. Pissing Pierre will... Oh. <coughs> I 
Actually, I think one good thing the anniversary did with this level and the next one was to to pretty much merge it into one level uh, and just take the most memorable moments of each of the levels uh, and, and, you know, put them into one because, uh, I, I mean, I, Peru is four levels and they're very short because, you know, it's the beginning of the game. Hang on, I'm not quite safe here because we're kind of at the halfway point and Pierre's about to turn up fucking again. Um, Peru is four levels and then the, the next two sections are three levels. I mean, granted, they're longer, but um, the Greece section is five levels long and one could argue it's maybe just a bit too bulky. So I think actually uh, streamlining these two levels into one. Where are you, dude? Hi! Oh, God almighty, it's like a game of Resident Evil. Bloody, what was it called? Mercenaries or something? Where everybody just stands still and shoots at each other. <clears throat> Come on dude, run away! Run away! No, run- No, dude, don't do that! Did I actually see him disappear? Did we actually see him literally disappear? Just- Huh. Oh well, okay. So, before we do anything, I think if I remember correctly... Is there not? Oh, well, there is a medipack up there. I can't remember if there's a secret up here or not. Oh, there's another one over there as well. Oh, so many medipacks. Right. Oh, yes, 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 I see it. I just caught a glimpse of it there. That's a secret up there, isn't it? I think so anyway. Again, no chimes to tell me. Oh, shotgun shells. Oh, I do have to do a running uh, slidey. Ah, oh, there we go. Shotgun shells. Oh my god, I think a part of the wall just warped. That was weird. Okay, so presumably I can just slide back. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, thanks a bunch. That's like an exit to a secret that's... Oh, right. So, hmm. Hmm. Right, I probably can't make that jump. Go this way. So much goodies, but we should pick them up. They'll probably come in handy later on. It's probably why Pierre's so pissed all the time. We chase him away before he can get some of these goodies himself. <sighs> said, I mean, Chronicles kind of wreck on the history between Lara, Pierre and Larson. And did we not basically leave him... Can I safety fall? Guess we're about to find out. Uh, uh, oh, right, okay. Uh, uh, Medipack. Um... <laughs> Did we not leave him for dead? Was he not dangling off the edge and we kind of sweet talk- Lara kind of sweet talked him into uh, helping her back up and then she kind of- uh, well she was basically a bit of a bitch and caused him to- there's a rat frozen again- uh, caused him to fall over and then she was like au revoir or some bullshit like that. I mean what a cow. I mean really. 
So no wonder he keeps shooting at us every time he bloody sees us. Right. Where are we down through the tunnel? Wow, I haven't played Chronicles in a long time. Chronicles and Tomb Raider 3, I just can't get on with either of them at all. I think it's just the kind of broken nature of the story that, that is basically many adventures, which is kind of silly really, I mean. I mean, one could argue that this one sort of is as well, the way the, the settings are split up into four. But it still has like an over uh, an overarching story to it, you know, like, I know the story is pretty minimalistic back in these, uh, these early games, but still, you know, by the standards of the day, for an action-adventure platformy type game, you know, the story in this game is pretty compelling. Right. Oh, what the hell is this? Oh, come on, Lara, get up, get up, come on. Sliding. Right, so then... So we've got... Ah, good, right, okay, so then we can go back over to the other one and... Yeah, so really you can do the first half of it with the water lord and then the second half with it um, raised, but it oh, always makes me nervous. Uh, but yeah, I mean it's just such a confusing level the first time you come to it. Right, where are we going? Up the ways. Key. Hang on a minute. Have we? I've only got. Oh, fucking hell. I've missed something somewhere, haven't I? I have, haven't I? Oh, God. This happens every bloody time. Oh, God damn it. There's a crocodile. Ah. <sighs> I wonder if it's a tunnel. Let's just go back this way again and see, because I'm sure you go in here and you pick up... Yeah, because these doors are the ways into picking up the... I'm sure they are. It's not just the gold key you get here, I'm sure. Right, so that's the way we just went. Yes! I remember. There's the, the bit through the first door. Ah, uh, yeah, there's the bit you can't do the, the, the lever thingy until the water's up. So we basically have to go this way again, do we? Or am I possibly... Right, it's quite... it's entirely possible... Wait a minute, wait a minute. No, I'm going the long way round. See, 
See what I mean about it's not that confusing a floor plan and yet it just has a way of... There is the other door. Was it this? Yeah, there it is, there. But what was the other door I came out of? It's not that, is it? That's the one... No, that's the one we've just come out of. There is another one. Where was it? No. Where was it? Oh, we came out there, didn't we? Yeah, we came out of the pool. Let's get some air. Uh, now, my experience of Let's Plays means there's probably people watching this tearing their hair out in frustration at me getting lost. Like, oh, it's, it's so obvious, you go this way. Uh, yeah, it was. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think these tunnels are quite confusing as well. Yes, here we go. Ah. Uh, I'm quite impressed with myself actually that I sussed it out this quickly because, I mean, seriously, this level. Yeah, but ah, oh, yeah, there we go, there's the other key. Huzzah! But we want to get the pickups first. Ah, oh, god damn it, aim in the. Was there another one over there? Yeah, for god's sakes, Lara. Aim at the rat that's chewing on your ankles. I have you. Oh. Right, so. Um, this bit here? Yep. And I believe. I think it's just three secrets in this level. And. Here's the third. And I believe this is the. The. Um, infamous secret that you can't get to on the Sega Saturn because do you not push the block away and then it's just like a wall um 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 oh ah right okay boom through ah there we go magnum clips is there anything else in here Oh, med medipack. Oh, more magnum clips. Oh, oh, Sistrin, you're spoiling us. <laughs> oh, sorry, Lara. Actually, we should probably save here before we go into the last section of the game. Yeah, well, let's just save right here. It's kind of weird how in St. Francis's Fall you've got four keys and it always so it just defaults to the, um, there's bad guys in here. It does seem to just default to the, the key that you want, but here it always seems to want you to use the gold key. And you know Lara's always very strict about uh, using items that uh, won't actually work. Oh look, there's the gorilla, and he is frozen. We can't shoot frozen enemies. Oh, 
Okay. weird you just kind of froze. Now admittedly the power of these uh, floors is slightly ruined by the fact that you can, hang on a minute, I saw it a moment ago, there we go we can see the spikes, uh, but we should be fine if we just run, jump, now I was always very confused by this because it opens that door but oh fuck me I was gonna say I don't um oh my god die already please die why the fuck are they not dying Yeah, this room really confuses me because I don't think, is there anything in there? I mean, is it literally just a trap to make you bring some, because the door's going to shut behind. Hang on a minute. Yeah, the door shuts behind, doesn't it? Or am I just imagining all of this? And then there's a lever and then there's... It's a very confusing room. <sighs> Unless there's a fourth secret here that I haven't clocked in on before, but I don't know. I, I think I might have pulled the. Come on, Lara. I think I might have pulled the block in at one point, but that in itself is, you know, a very slow and boring thing to do. Into the tomb of Tehokin we go. Oh, into the tomb of Tehokin we go, Lara. Ah! ah, three of three secrets, half an hour. Actually, that's not too shabby at all. Uh, considering I got lost at one point. Uh, and considering it, it probably took me bloody weeks back in the day to do this. Yeah, that was jolly good fun.